So I'm Michael, one of the heating supervisors for Elite Renewables. We're on the Sonin Lock, which is just a small island off the Thames. So this is a Samsung air source heat pump that we've installed. Our heat pump is providing hot water for a 500 litre cylinder, which is for all of the bathrooms and the hot water needs of the house, and a 100 litre heating buffer for supplying the underfloor heating and the radiators to the rest of the property. So one of the reasons people ask why we've got a 500 litre cylinder in what's effectively quite a small house is because one of the things we really concentrate on is not just the minimum standard according to the dwelling but also its lifestyle. How do they live? How many bathrooms? How many people? And this house particularly is more of a party house. So it's got quite heavy consumption through the showers and therefore what we install has to be fit for purpose. And a lot of installers don't understand that. They just go, this is what it needs. We look at it and go, how does someone live? Because it does influence decisions. We've also installed seven solar panels on the roof, which is supplying power for the house, as well as um, a Tesla power wall. Interesting project because obviously we've had to negotiate the lock. Access was a little bit difficult. It's quite an unusual setting at this one. so. We've had to bring everything across the lock gates. We were on and off this project quite a bit, so it was in a lot of stages. It was probably a two-year project. There was a lot of development issues and um, obviously waiting around for builders that, to get their works done so that we can come in after. Obviously, with plant rooms, they need to be in a, in a finished state. Um, so sometimes it's a case of getting some primary work done, which is what we did here, pull away from site for a while and then let the builders catch up and then we come back in afterwards to do our plant room. 